Hi, this is Anke for Golden Camera and I have the pleasure today to talk with Brie Larson for The Glass Castle. How important do you think a glass castles in life, as in dreams, whether they come true or not, but to have dreams in life? I mean, I love dreams. I think that that's how all of the good stuff happens. That's how we have electric cars. That's how we have chairs. Because someone was like, I don't want to stand up. I want to sit down and I want to figure out how to do it. So you build a chair. Like, it's those types of risk taking and dreams that I think are so important to have. They can be dangerous because they can give you delusions at times and make you blind to reality. But I don't think that that's really worth focusing on. I think that the most important thing is for us to be to be dreaming and to be taking risks and to be okay with the fact that risk means failure sometimes, but that's okay too. Mm -hmm. Failure is sometimes where the good stuff happens. Speaking of dreams come true um, and taking a risk, we'll see you next in, Inf uh, in Avengers Infinity War as Captain Marvel. Mm -hmm. How cool is that? Well, we don't know if I'm going to be in Infinity War, but oh, my, mm -hmm. my solo film, yes, I will be, I will be filming that soon. How cool do you feel that it is that you can portray this character now? Oh, it's so cool. And it just feels like it's getting more and more real as time goes on. And that's the part that feels exciting. Instead of just talking about it as like this thing <laughs> that's happening in the future, it's a thing that's like starting to happen. And um, the support has been very wonderful and overwhelming. And I'm so grateful for it. Um, making movies are really hard. And making a movie of this size is hard. But to see how important this film is to people and how excited they are about it just like makes it all completely worth it. it makes me want to work harder. Coming back to the glass castle, of course it shows family, also a very poor family. And we of course compared to that are all very rich. But besides um, financial uh, wealth, what, what on a daily basis makes you feel rich? And that can be the sunshine or, mm. you know, a little cup of tea in the morning or anything, but what makes you this just little tiny things that enrich your life? That's a really good question. You know, I think that for me, it's having this strong support system around me, and that's my fiance and my dogs, and my friends. Being able to have people that accept me is huge. And it's very hard for me to understand that there are people that don't have that because I believe that that should be a basic human right. We all deserve to have a champion. I have a lot of them. And so it's become more important to me as time goes on to become the champion of others because it's a game changer. I would not be where I am now if there weren't people that lifted me up. Mm -hmm. Whether that was my mom when I was crying for the 1,000th time that I didn't think I was going to get to be an actor or whether that was Destin telling me that I could be the lead of his film a couple years ago. We all need someone to be our cheerleader. Mm -hmm. Thank you so much. Yeah, thank you. <laughs>